French Defense, Advance, Paulson, Yawi Variation, 6.B2NGE7. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. Black had a good opening, but White was on another level. The middle game was messy, but White got the better of it. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. While preparing for d5, the French defense prevents the light squared bishop in favor of a strong center and opportunities for counterattacks. The center is fully controlled by d4 and the dark squared bishop is made available. The e4 pawn is threatened by the center counterattack on d5. E5 closes the center and attacks the important d6 and f6 squares. The d4 pawn is struck by c5, kicking off center play. The d4 pawn is supported by c3, which also enables the queen to grow on the queen side. And c6 adds more pressure to the d4 and e5 pawns. And f3 supports the d4 and e5 pawns. Bd7 develops the light squared bishop and opens up the c8 square. B2 develops the bishop and prepares castling. And GE7 develops the knight toward the center and supports the knight on C6, but blocks the dark squared bishop. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. Game's master. It is the final book action. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. That's good. Backs off. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. That's good. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. It is quite good. A powerful play. It is quite good. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. This misses the chance to offer an equitable exchange of pieces. That falls flat. There was just one smart move to be made. That falls flat. This misses the chance to provide an equitable exchange of pieces. That falls flat. That falls flat. This is a missed chance to offer an equal exchange of goods. It is incorrect. That's a decent move. That's good. This pins a knight, which restricts its mobility. This threatens to win a pawn. It is good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That is a regrettable error. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. It is a miss. A wise decision. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. The game was almost evenly matched, but black is now worse. It is incorrect. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is incorrect. This makes it impossible for the adversary to gain a pawn. It is quite good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. It's alright. That's good. The knight can now control more squares as a result. It is quite good. 
This misses the chance to move a queen to safety. It is incorrect. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This let the adversary could threaten a queen and win a tempo. It is incorrect. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is a great move. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. Now that white has lost their winning advantage, the score is about even. It is incorrect. Although it is possible to achieve equality, this action falls short. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. That falls flat. On the file, the rooks are strategically doubled and forcefully combined. That's good. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to kick a rook. It is incorrect. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. This allows the opponent to kick a rook. It is an inaccuracy. There was just one smart move to be made. This misses a chance to kick the rook. It is incorrect. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. This is the only good move. This threatens to win material. This prevents the opponent from being able to kick a rook. It is a great move. This is the only move that works. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is a great move. This results in the loss of a queen. It is a mistake. This seizes a helpless pawn. It is ideal. The queen is therefore moved to safety. It is quite good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. It is quite good. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. This avoids the knight's check. It's compelled. This divides up parts by launching multiple attacks at once. It is ideal. This moves away from the knight in shining armor. It is ideal. This gains a king. It is ideal. As a result, the adversary may play checkmate. That is a mistake. And the game is over. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. The middle game was messy, but white got the better of it.